Jim and Robbie Yankish, the father and son running Boardman's YM camera, love to talk cameras, even in an era when so many people have them on their cell phones. You know, I always said the cell phones and millennials were the best thing that ever happened to my business because it, it really striked their passion for photography and videography. The cell phone is good for some people and that's all they'll ever need, but there's a whole group of people that want something better. The roots of YM Camera can be traced to 1951 when photography buff Peter Yankish, Jim's father, started Youngstown Microfilm, transferring hospital records onto microfilm. He also developed the films for high school football teams. He had 70 schools. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you, you know, Borman, Fitch, and, you know, some Western PA stuff. And so there was 70 altogether. I got the Godox V862 for Nikon. As the technology of photography changed, Youngstown Microfilm changed to YM Camera. And with Robbie Yankish now part of the business, he's using social media to drive sales. It also offers rentals, both cameras and lenses. And there's also an upstairs room where photography classes are held. YM Camera is focused on education. We want to educate you on your camera. And the big thing here is, I don't care where you got your camera, uh, just come on in, we're your camera store now. Our gross revenue literally has doubled over the last two years. It's, it, things have exploded. Jim Yankish likes to talk about a friend of his in Philadelphia who once had 500 photography stores. Now he has four. I'm in a group of about 100. And I, I, would, I would think that um, there's probably 50 or 60 that are like really strong. And one of those 50 or 60 is YM Camera. Heck yeah, okay. yeah, we're rocking and rolling. In Boardman, Stan Boney, WKBN 27 First News.